All right. First and foremost, we give all praises and glory to Yahweh, Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem, Kakadash, double on some parts of editors, GMS, and citation to your brother, pushing word with truth. Truth is sitting on four corners. On the brother, Tyson, one for GMS, Mississippi Camp. I'm going to do a quick lesson tonight on this article. All got uh, seen on um, news break, and the title just say history. Who was your ha Jesus biological father, and which his real name is Yahweh Shai. And um, I'm gonna read something. Or I ain't gonna read all of it, uh, all of it. Uh, but but this so many people, these people really think <laughs> that that Yahweh Shai don't have a father, an earthly father. Mm. That thing, a, a, a spirit got, a, a, a angel spirit got 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 a pregnant. You know, that's what they've been told for years. And these preachers, these, these preachers and pastors, and never really broke it down to them. Everybody just think, how she just appeared. You know, no, just just she was pregnant with without with a man touching her. And that's far from the, the truth. I am going to read some of this article. Uh, history. Who was Yahushua's biological father? Doing, doing, doing some small talk with a neighbor today. She said, something I had never heard, heard of thoughts about before. In religious studies groups, this week someone said that nobody has ever factually known who was the biological father of Jesus, Yahweh Shai, was. She said, I was raised in Zion Luther Church, Wisconsin, Sanaa, where faith and teaching tell us to go go with that, go with what's written, or else prepare to have our faith tested by others. Regarding my childhood upbringing, I was intrigued and decided to research the topic, and I was surprised to read the vast amount of literature from the scholars, scientists, and believers stated that the biological that the biological no slap that the biblical biblical accounts of how shy birth was was not was debatable for centuries. Even more ironic was that the most controversial specific aspect of this topic was and still is identified the Y'all yeah, shot biological father. And they got all kind of stuff, man. They got the ancient Egypt, Hinduism. And they, I think these are type of religions, I guess. Yeah. And I'm just going to skip on down. Like I said, it's a, it's, a Native, it's a Native American religious. And some Native American religious religions, such as Navajo and Hop, because uh concept of a Magdalene birth also present. The Navajo, the Navajo creation tells the story of a woman who become pregnant through the power of the sun and give birth to the first human and hops <clears throat> to the first human and hop mythology. The spider woman, <laughs> what well, the spider woman is said, have given birth to the first human without involving a male partner. God damn, no, fuck that. All right, it's in the Christianity, and that's probably the Christianity, the, the Christians. It's in the Christianity belief. Jesus was not only divine being, but also a human being who lived and taught to die in history. Research, I researched um, ancient DNA for 10 years, studied with the Natural Geographic or Geo Project, given what I, given what I know today. Even if Jesus' DNA could be discovered, it would be extremely difficult to cons to conclusively prove that, that it belonged to him. Because that, that um man, that they all trying to figure out some shit, and they always wrong. All right, DNA testing require a a known sample in DNA to compare against that there are they are that there are. No known sample of you have Jesus DNA to use as reference, so you can't get no DNA from uh, from Jesus. You can't. 
He's not even here. Yeah, how shall I mean? With that being said, Matthew recalled him the angelic visitation to to Joseph and from him that Mary became pregnant by the Holy Spirit while he <laughs> emphasized yeah, Jesus Yahweh yeah, divine organ organ oh, I said organ organ not organ but um it origin and his fulfillment of the t Old Testament Prophecy, he, he do not directly address the question of Yahweh Shah Balaji your father. All right. But basically, like they said, that they, they really just think that the whole spirit got Mary pregnant. All right. And which is like, which is false. Real false. It said the phrase, her husband Joseph being a righteous man is unwilling to put her, put her to shame. Resolving that to divorce her quietly, oh my goodness, divorce her <laughs> implies that Joseph was not the biological father. Moreover, Angelette announcement to the Joseph emphasizes that the child was conceived by the Holy Spirit and not by human. Hey, this all madness, to be honest with you. This all madness. I ain't going to read no more of this, man. going <laughs> to... It's saying all kind of crazy shit, really. Mm -hmm. Basically, like I said, they just think, um, yeah, I was shy. Um, well, well, Mary was praying about an angel. That's what they applying. That's what everybody think in the world, but they wrong. But, um, I'm going to go to, uh, Matthews, I'm gonna start at Matthew one, and I'm, I'm uh, and one, and I'm gonna start at uh, eighteen. Now the birth of Yahusha, Masha, was on the wise. Was on the wise when his mother, when his mother Mary, Mary was spouse to Joseph. Before they came together, she was she was confounded with child. All right, she was founded with child of the Holy Spirit. Basically, saying he 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 had the um, the knowledge and understanding of the spirit of Yahweh Bashi That's that's all it really means. He had he, he had the knowledge. All right. Verse nineteen. Then Joseph, her, her husband, being being a just man and not willing to make her a public example, was mine to to put her away privately. All right. But when he thought of these things, behold, the angel of the Most High appeared unto him in a dream, saying, "Joseph, thy son of David, fear not to take unto thee. If he said, fear not to take unto thee." Mary, thy wife, for that which she is conceived in her is the Holy Spirit. All right. Verse, verse one, and she she should bring forth a son, and that should call his name Yahweh Shai, and he should save his people, and that's what Yahweh Shai means, the saver, save his people. Who's the people? So called Negroes, Latinos, and Native Americans. All right. And now this was done. That it might be filled with spoken of the Lord by the prophet, saying, "Behold, a virgin I means just a, a a young lady. That's all I mean, a young lady. All right, she bring she bring a child, and she she she'll, she'll be with a child, and she'll bring forth a son, and they should call him Emmanuel, which being interpreted, God is with us. All right, verse twenty four. Then yeah, then Joseph being right risen from the sleep, right raised from his sleep, and did as the angel of the Most High had bid him, taken to his wife. All right, and I'm gonna look at the word took. Let me see the word took. You know. Let me see the word took, man. Let me Mm, 
I don't think that's the word I'm trying to get. Uh, no. Oh, no, that ain't the word I'm trying to get. All right, here we go. <clears throat> Back at the end. Verse 25, that's what I want. And he knew her not until she had brought forth her firstborn son, and she called him Yahweh Shai. And I look at the word new. I'm looking at the word new in the Greek. Uh, the word new in the Greek. It is. Strong's G, 1097. Gnosko. 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 All right. And definition three is a session intercourse between a man and a woman. Because you know how Jake's like, I know her. Like, you know her. Because you know you had, you, you, you dealt with her before. And, and that, and that word in, um, that Greek word in, in uh, new, um, Gnosko, basically, session intercourse between a man and a woman. That's how he knew her. He, they had sex. All right? That's all. I mean, they had sex for the marriage or, or, or the ceremony. That's all it really was. But, you know, but but these churches got everybody thinking that Mary just had a, <laughs> had a, 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 she was pregnant just, just uh, by, by the Holy Spirit, by, by angels. And angels don't have sex. All right. This is the uh, wisdom of Solomon 7 and 1. I myself is a mortal man like, uh, like, like to all. And the offspring of him that was the first made of the earth. And my mother womb fashioned me to be flesh in the time of 10 months being compacted in blood. And of the seed of man. Alright. From the seed of man. Alright. And pleasure that came with sleep. Verse 3. And when I was born, I drew in coming air. I fell upon the earth. It's like when you giving birth. And which which is up it's like which is of like natural. And the first voice was I other was crying. As all others do. <laughs> all right. As soon as baby come out, they cry. He said, verse 4, I would nurse and swaddle cloth, cloth, clothing that was carried. But here, here, here's the point. For there is no king that had any other beginning. All right. For there is no king that had any other beginning of birth. Beginning of birth. So guess what? Order to come on, on uh, the order to come to the world, a man and woman got got to get together, and, and have sex, and baby come. That's it. There's no any and there's no any other way. They gonna happen. So the women say, you know how they, they might use that. You know how women like, like two like two women, but you know one of them be pregnant or whatever like that. But guess what? They had a seed. They got a seed from a man. All right. The seed came from a man. So I don't know what the people, I guess the people just don't understand the Bible, really. At the same time, it's not meant them to understand anyway. All right, with that, y'all brothers say strong. We almost on. I give y'all praises and glory to Yahweh, Bahashim, Yahweh Shai, Bahashim, Bakakadash, the ones to the Pastor Edison, GMS, and so I taste to your brother, push a word, but true. Truth is a serious shallow one.